Amy with Amy McKeon Art. Happy Earth Day, everyone. Today, in honor of Earth Day, I have decided to do a painting using things in my art room that need a little upcycling. So I have here a canvas that has been used once, scraped because I didn't like the painting, and we're gonna use it again. So I have um, applied a little bit of gesso on it um, because it was a lot bluer and the base I'm using for this I think is gonna be white. So I didn't want it to show through. All my paints here, if you can see them, are recycled paints. These are from paintings I've done before and had left over. This green here is about three different colors of green um, to make a custom green, which is actually really nice. Again, the same thing with this one. This is several blues, grays, and some black. I combined together to get that color. Some more greens. Um, this, I believe, is Modern Masters Gold mixed with maybe oyster and some white. Um, we'll see how that goes. I'm hoping that this is kind of going to be a pour over and the pearls are going to pop up through this one. This I had marked TLP. So it said this little piggy pigment and I'm not sure what color that is, but kind of looks like blue eyes, but I'm getting a little gold. So I think I've mixed it up with something as well, maybe indigo waves. Um, this was several different golds mixed up to get a gold. So we're not real sure what's in there. This one is another green. I'm not sure what it is either. Um, kind of looks like a piggy, but I'm sure it's a mix of several things. Um, so we're just gonna see what we get today by reusing these paints. Um, this is going to be a pearl mix um, base. At least I'm hoping it is. It was on my desk and it had it was living with all my old like pearl cups where i'd pearled so i'm going to assume that's what it is it's been sitting a while i zhuzhed it up a little bit and hopefully get all the ingredients activated and uh, we're going to see how that goes as everyone knows in fluid art you use a lot of products you lose a lot of paint a lot of cups and um we always try as artists who do this to do the best we can for our environment and not to use up so many things to reuse our paints and obviously I'm reusing a canvas but another way that you can help is by using paper cups these um, aren't as bad as plastic because they are uh, they will decom decompose um, the plastic cups that I do use like this one um, I will not throw it away obviously i reuse it over and over and i do like it because it has my measurements on here but so if i use plastic for any reason even if it's just like a little condiment cup i just wash them or reuse them over and over again but i do like to use my paper and then i let after they're empty and i've scraped all the paint out i let them dry and then i recycle those just try to be mindful and do your part to help our environment and our puppy pads here. Um, I know that I do use these and this helps keep the mess up in my art room. But before the paint sinks down in and becomes gelatinous in these pads, I scrape it off. But I will also reuse them a couple times. Like this one, I was doing some tests on. So I'll use it for quite a while before I go to the next one. And when I'm doing my tests and practices, this thing will be a total mess. Um, I reuse it and reuse it. I don't like to waste those. They're not cheap. So I'm gonna turn some music on, let y'all just watch, and I'll check in at the end.
pearl mix. It did exactly what I wanted it to do, but holy cow, look at those pearls. Wow, okay, well, I think I'm gonna do a Dutch over it. Almost think I'm gonna do it this way. That way might be a little much. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna do it right through here and maybe even two lines of it. Wow, a lot of pearls. Okay guys, I'll uh, start that music back up and I'll see you in another minute.
wanted to pop in here as we're getting close to the end and I hope you can tell kind of what I'm going for here. My vision was to create a landscape using the pearl and dutch method and my first one i didn't quite get there and this one is turning out more how i envisioned i've always been a little bit obsessed with landscape paintings and abstract art and so i thought maybe i could just try to combine the two of these i plan to do um, a lot more of these so i hope you enjoy it um, i've got a couple more um, that i'll be releasing in the next few weeks Again, happy Earth Day. Thanks for watching. If you could, give me that thumbs up down there at the bottom. Subscribe, comment, and I really hope to see you down on the canvas again soon.